What up, y'all? It's your boy Juggle972 back here, and I'm uh, with here misunderstood. I know. And you are seeing this absolutely correct. You are seeing Star Fox 2, and yes, you are seeing this. This is not the beta, but this is the complete version on the SNES Classic. Absolutely. Wow. What do you think? This is absolutely amazing. Oh, definitely. Yeah. Now, uh, let me um let you in on something. Go ahead. We did a live stream two years ago. Right. The Star Fox uh, uh, gameplay. Yeah, that's right. With, we with did. our friend Rezekill. Yeah, with uh, Rezekill as well. Yeah, we uh, did a, uh, a live stream of uh, Star Fox, and uh, I figured this would be just a different way to approach it, though, because this, this felt very special. Now, during our live stream, I did mention this game. Yes. Yes, you did. And, um... Uh -huh. Um, but yeah, I did mention this, and, uh... And this is the game that I'm talking about. Oh, absolutely. Now, keep in mind, I have played... Oh, that's interesting. Look at that. Hmm. Normal, hard, and expert. Looks like we have to unlock it. Alright. Now, let me get the... Let me just start off by, let me just get the Hannah thing, see if this plays different. Because I've played the beta version. Right. And, um, I've beaten him on all three difficulties. Now, as I've said uh, in the uh, first Star Fox live stream, uh -huh. um, normal is pretty much a piece of cake. Well, you never know now that the final version's out. Hard was actually pretty hard and expert. Holy fuck, I was going to tear my hair out. Sorry, 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 sorry. Sorry, a little, little malfunction there. Alrighty. Now, how about you walk us through this a little bit? Okay, so basically what's going on, sorry that I skipped through the uh, intro. Mm -hmm. Um, basically what's going on is that Andros has returned, hey, the fiend... Yeah, oh, I thought it said friend there for a, set, for a second. Oh no, he's not a friend. Not Our short enemy, Fiend Andros, is alive. Even as we speak, he is launching an assault on Corn Area. The battle carriers and attack forces of Andros are now advancing on Corn Area. Enemy bases have been established on overrun planets. Planetary missiles will be fired from these enemy bases. I repeat, planetary missiles. Meaning, Fired from bases. Yeah. yeah. Once again, we must ask you for your assistance, Starbox. Cornelia will survive but sustains minor damage. But if damage reaches 100, you're fucked, basically. Basically, it just, you know, pulls a Vegeta destroying a fucking planet. Yeah, engages the forces of the Andros while at the same time keeping damage at Cornelia at the lowest level possible. Good luck. So, well, base. Go ahead. Uh, you, basically, you know, it's, um,. A galactic version of chess. Oh, yes. And you know, now you guys know how much of chess freaks we are. Alright, here we go. Now, the cool part about this, though, is the fact that every uh, pilot here has a different uh, kind of set of abilities, too. Yes, absolutely. Now, if you look at... Fox and Falco are pretty much uh, balanced. Uh-huh. And Falco, my favorite guy. Pappy... Uh, has more shield. Definitely the tougher of the vets. Yeah, and, and, and apparently, and Slippy does too. Slippy is actually useful. Well, he's always useful. He's technically sound. Mm -hmm. Uh, Mio, these are the rookies. These have, these, uh, this is Faye, and this is Mio. Pardon the uh, back and forth, back and forth. Can't take it anymore. These are the fastest. So with this one, I'm gonna go with uh, Falco. Okay. And uh, I'm actually gonna go with her. Okay, and Falco and you. Now, are you able to switch out? Yes. Hmm. Like chess. Yeah. Okay, here we go. So basically, what you have to do is. Avoid Corneria being attacked. 
Let me rephrase that, that sounded very odd. You gotta protect Corneria from... from Annihilation, pretty much. Okay. Now, I've played the beta version. The, um... How do you say this? The wording in the game is a little different compared to this. This one yeah. seems final. This one actually... It's like, uh, the beta was like a rough draft, in other words. Well, that's what, a, what all betas are. Now, switch positions with the wingman by pressing select. That's all you have to do. Okay. Okay, let's go do it. Alright. Oh yeah, you can also move the mothership on this, too. Yes. You can also move the mothership to, uh... You can also go we're, to the mothership. We're gonna call the mothership Great Fox. Yeah. Okay, because that's what we know it as. Yeah, well, Great Fox... Great Fox? You have to excuse me. I am running on four hours of sleep. I got up eight in the morning to get this wonderful Super Nintendo classic. Um, anyway, you can go to Great Fox to regenerate your shield. Okay. Alright, now, these are the battleships. These are the ones that are going to be firing uh, on... Corneria. They're mainly going to be the ones dealing the most damage. These carriers, these battleship carriers. Now these missiles, they do the least. And the fighters. Okay, well let's get to the action, shall we? Alright, which, okay. Eeny, meeny, miny. How about we make our way to the carrier over there? This one? Yeah, I think it'll be a good idea. Mo. Now, here's another thing, too. You can also switch. Now, mind you, this is the very, very first attempt of us actually playing this. So, you know, we're actually getting a feel for it. An actual complete feel. And that was jack shit compared to that. Mm hmm So that right there was just a mulligan, really. Now, this is normal mode, keep in mind. Um... We are going to do the harder difficulties as well, just like we did on the first live stream. I can't wait to see how uh, the hard difficulty is, though, because playing the beta mode, uh, you know, there was some quirks to it, though. But the one thing I liked about the beta was the fact that, you know, there were different enemies. Yeah. Oh, shit. Okay, what do we got? Me is actually really fucking awesome. Oh! What was that? That was my Nova Bomb. Oh, nice. Now, in this game, Nova Bombs are, um... Nova Bombs are called special weapons. Okay. Shield is also a special weapon. Okay, well that's, uh... Well, they've definitely made it a commodity in this game. Because mm -hmm. I remember the Shield in the very first game, or any of the games, actually being something to grasp for, though, but they don't last very long. Oh yeah, let me um, let me uh point something else out. This right here is the satellite defense platform. This will help you in defeating the enemy. And it's slowly charging up. So. And if you ask me though, on a chessboard, this would probably be the bishop. Oh yeah. Corneria is the king piece. Yeah, you just happen to have two queens if you think about it though. Yeah. I like the fact that they kept the original sound effects in it from the beta as well from the uh, very first game. Mm -hmm. And then they brought it in. It, it really feels like a direct sequel. Mm -hmm. Definitely an upgrade from the very first game. Here, here, that's, 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 this regenerates your seal. Cool. Alrighty. Let me just, I need a warning. Warning, planetary missile headed for Corneria. Oh yeah, that's another thing you also gotta remember too. There's a uh, almost semi-real-time, like, uh, events going on, you know, while you battle, too. Yes. Yeah, that's one thing I've also uh, remembered about the beta, was the, uh, you know, the real-time, uh, events going on. So you really have to, you know, play to, you know, to the time as well. Yes, absolutely. Now, how are the controls, you know, based, uh, from this one as opposed to the, uh, beta version? Okay, uh, they're pretty much the same. Oh, yeah, let me show you something. If you played Star Fox Zero, this is where this came from. Yeah. And we got a General Pepper coin. 
Jenna pepper corn. Corn? I'm sorry. Coin! That's actually a uh, flavor of uh, popcorn, actually, I believe. Yeah. Or actually, peppercorn chips. Yeah. Uh, the peppercorn regenerates uh, your barrier as well. Or shield, whatever. Here we go. Okay. And all you gotta do is basically... If I understand, though, you know, use the, uh, the D-pad to walk up, down, left, and right. Basically, uh, very PC style. Yeah, and you use the L and R buttons to turn. Right, right, to turn your turrets. Yes. Okay. Oh, man. I'll never forget the very first time uh, I saw the Star Fox 2 beta. It was like 2007. You were actually watching a couple of videos. That was 10 years ago. Yeah, it was 10 years ago, yeah. Yeah, I, w I was taking a nap, but I, was, I just came home from school. Mm -hmm. And then all I remember was waking up and just hearing just random, you know, Star Fox noises, right? I get up, and you're watching this, yes. and I'm not gonna lie, I, I, I pulled up a chair, I'm like, just dumbfounded by what I saw. <laughs> oh, wait, hold up. Well, I'll be damned. Oh! <laughs> the Great Leon. Another thing. The introduction to Star Wolf. Yeah, Star Fox 2 marked the introduction of Star Wars. If you look at Leon right now, he's far more uglier. Yeah. Well, he kind of looks like Assault. Or he kind of looks like um, his figure from Assault. Yeah, from Assault. Yeah, I, I liked um, Leon in 64, to be honest with you. Well, what is I thought? You can also charge your blaster as well. To create oh, yeah. extra damage. You can lock on the enemy as well. You have to excuse my aiming. There we go. I just got home from work too, so. And you can also, um. You can also do a barrel roll to, to dodge a uh, strong uh, blast as well. Whoa! Oh, yeah, and there's meteors too. Yeah. Those are very real. <laughs> Ooh, that Nova Bomb skills, got him. But I would not lose. Special weapons. Okay, I also want to point out in the beta version there was no background. The background was green, but no asteroids in the back. <laughs> Catwolf is gonna have to deal with you. Leon has been defeated. Me? Me? Quote, quote, quote uh, Leon and Star Fox Assault. Not yet. The party's just begun. Oh. It appears a puny pet rat is running about. How cute. Uh-oh. <gasps> Go play with your pet. Just play nice. <laughs> oh, here we go. Very interesting. I'm gonna go ahead and switch. You're definitely um, gonna need somebody tougher, and Falco is gonna be the, uh, the chess piece for this one. Actually... Me, um... I've actually used Mew before. Let me tell you something about the new... the newbies. They all... both of them, Faye and Mew, start off with, um... Well, in the beta version, they started off with Moon Blasters. Yeah, I remember that, actually. That's obviously changed. That's obviously changed, yeah. Yeah, that is a bit weird, though, but... I think it's for the challenge, though. Oh, boy. Oh, her special weapon is shield. This is what the shield looks like. Now, from what I understand, though, you can actually, uh... You can actually, uh, run from the fight, too, right? You can retreat. I think you can. Yeah, you can. Man, this would have been great on a Windows 95 PC. It would have, yes. Back in the day. Falco, I think, in this game, played... Whoa! Yeah, he's a dragon. Yeah, Mirage Dragon. There you go. Just like in the first game. You're currently using Falco right now, right? I'm using Mew, not... Oh, uh, Mew? Okay. I think I made, I made a great mistake. Yeah, there's definitely a balance out now. There we go. Oh! Yeah, Mirage Dragon defeated. Okay. 
Now this is yeah. where Great Fox comes in. Great Fox will cover you. Alrighty. Oh, oh shit, here we go. Uh, do not... Oh, <laughs> fuck. I, I need to point out, the, the missile landing in Corneria was the silliest landing I'd ever seen. I know. <laughs> you can also warp with the mothership as well. Okay, so you definitely want to move the king a little bit further. Yeah. Now, Great Fox has regenerated both our shields. We can also warp via mothership. Okay, so repairs have been done. And we can oh, Macbeth, Titania, and the asteroid belt, right? Mm-hmm. As long as they don't... Yeah, okay, excuse me, I'm rusty. As long as they don't have enemy forces. Alrighty. Of course, you know, we got two missiles right here, too, so this shouldn't be a problem. Yeah. And, um... The only thing about the newbies is that they they use too much energy. In what in what way? Look at the blaster meter. Oh, okay. Well, actually, uh, I think what's what that is that they don't have enough output to it. That's probably what you mean. Yeah. Here we go. Okay, we have to catch there it. is a there are wing blasters in here. Now, as opposed to uh, the last Star Fox game, Star Fox Zero, like when you max out your, uh, your wing blaster, mm -hmm. the, the hyper wing blaster though, it's for a limited amount of time. Does this wing blaster last until you die or when you get a wing damage? Now, when I played the, the beta version, sometimes it lasted uh, all the way to the end and sometimes it didn't. At least in the beta version we downloaded. Okay, yeah, because I know there was a couple of uh, different uh, uh, downloads that we did. Oh, now you see that star right there? Yeah, we even bought a reproduced cartridge to the most complete version of it, though. Mm -hmm. Of course, but there was no complete version of it, so... Yeah. So I'll put that in quotes. I, I know the... What do we got? Oh! Speak oh, what's of the this? devil! I picked up the Star Wolf wing. <laughs> Andros paid me well. And this will be an easy job. No. No, it won't. Oh, man. I think I just got swine flu just by reading that. Yeah. That reward's as good as mine! There you are, asshole. You're not bad for an amateur. Well, me, you, is an amateur. Well, he's a rookie. She's a green. novice. An amateur. You're flying too slow. Boost! Falco oh! Is so is Fox. But Fox is the leader too. Yeah. And Falco is more the uh, the grizzled vet. The grizzled young vet, if you will. Yeah. He's a grizzled young vet. And um, Falco is more of, the, of a brash. And a, bit of, and a bit of a pessimist. Mm hmm. Oh man. But Falco, I like to think of him as a necessary. But you know what, you gotta you know, there's there's the good cop back up, there's the the righteous leader, and then there's one, you know, who gets things done by being an asshole. Yeah, that's pretty much Falco. Yeah. But Falco can always get the job done, that's why I love him so much. Oh yes indeed, yeah. He knows sometimes he has to be an asshole. Sometimes you gotta be a dick, though, you know what I mean? Yeah, sometimes you gotta be a dick. Put it this way, though, you can be a dick, and people respect you, and people respect you, or you can be an asshole, and be brash, and be like, you know what, this guy is a fucking piece of shit, but you know, he got it done. Yeah. Three kinds of people in this world, dicks, dicks pussies, and, and assholes. assholes. As we said in the... Yeah, we said that in the, uh, the playthrough, too. Yeah. Yeah, we actually live, like I said, we live streamed uh, the complete uh, Star Fox playthrough that we did. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh! Oh! Peppercoin. General Peppercoin. I want to say these are continues as well. Actually, now when you go into the walker mode, we used to, we used to think this was the Landmaster mode. Yeah, we used to think that too. That was a pretty good, um, pretty good assumption when you think about it. Yeah. I do like... 
I do like uh, that you have to go in the battleships and destroy everything. Let me get back up here. Yeah, because I know, uh, what was it, uh, some of the, the uh, Star Wars games that came out later on, the uh, later generations, mm -hmm. uh, use that same concept. Ah! I think uh, Star Fox 2, though, was kind of the first to really try to make that from, a, from an all-range mode perspective. Yeah. In fact, if anybody can guess this, what, what battle introduced all-range mode? A very limited version of all-range mode. You know, if you can leave it in the comment section below, then you're awesome. Yes. Okay. Okay, that's down. Yeah, you can definitely tell me Sunday still plays this a little bit more than I did. Yeah. Now, the time that I played it, though, I a total amount of hours uh, that I've ever given the beta was probably about four and a half hours. She probably put about maybe 10 to 11 hours into it, though. Mm -hmm. And mind you, we both did really good. However, in an emulator, uh, in an emulator point, we use uh, a PS4 controller, uh, PS3 controller, uh, an Xbox 360 controller, so, you know, it was fluid, but at the same time, it wasn't. Okay, so, now we're going into a planet and destroying the enemy force. Basically, you know, just going to destroy a barrier. Alright, here is another trivia. Eladar. Oh, God! Did, did somebody just come Akazi into me? Obviously failed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. There's there was speculation about this planet Eladar. The forgotten planet forever forever be overshadowed in the name of Zonus from Star Fox 64. Yes. If you uh if you remember from uh, Star uh, Star Fox 64, uh right at the beginning, uh Peppy says, "This is Zonus." And then you hear uh, Falco say, I can't believe they did this. What a dump! I hear you slipping. Okay, now here's... Now they're about to fire off this missile, by the way. So you, you want to destroy that shit. Missile pad taken care of. That actually saved us a lot of time. That actually did, yeah. What took, like, literally a second and a half right there, mm -hmm. took... A way it gave us back actually about maybe what five seven maybe 20 seconds maybe more? yes absolutely now I know there's a goddamn blaster around here somewhere let me just let me just let me uh, fly instead of walk everywhere oh yes this right here generate replenishes your shield oh yeah so if you ever need if you ever need to replenish your shield, that's always... Definitely a repair, so we're full, so we're good. Yeah. Fuck it. You know what? Fuck it. I'm just gonna go in and take care of this. But when Falco said, I can't believe they, zip, they did this... He was mentioning Eladar. Yes. Well, it's speculated that he mentioned Eladar. Yeah. Because, you know, on Star Fox, though, there wasn't really much, you know, story behind it other than, you know, James McCloud's, you know, Fox McCloud. You know, this is way before, you know, the uh, mention of a Star Wolf. Yeah. Way before. And way, yeah. There's also a theory. So, yeah, Eladard and, Eladard and Zonus was pretty much a theory, along with James McCloud. Um... Uh, um, transitioning into, uh, transitioning? Did I seriously just I think what that? you're trying to say is, like, uh, being lost in the, in the, uh, black hole. In the black hole, yeah, and ending up in the F-Zero world. Yeah, there's a, I remember hearing about that, though, that was, a. Uh... And I, I, we, I did tell, I did say in the last live stream that we were going to talk about that. Now, here's what I don't understand. Okay. Obviously, you know, the uh, F-Zero franchise is, uh, you know, in the, the world of Nintendo. Makes sense. But why not show up on, uh, what is it, uh, Super Smash Brothers? Why not, yeah. That would be cool. I would love to, hear, uh, to see that. Special weapon. Okay. Me and special, special weapon. weapon. Now, when you get a special weapon, it'll, you'll hear Fox McCloud say, uh, special, special weapon. weapon. Kind of um, like when you hear a wing blaster or wing repaired. Yeah. 
needs for the core. And uh, James McLeod in the F Zero series is actually a human. Really? Yeah. From what I saw, correct me if I'm wrong. Wrong. And uh, don't, that please don't call me dumb. <laughs> <laughs> But, uh, yeah, you said that James McLeod is a, uh... He looks uh, like a human in the... <laughs> it's, uh, another dimension when you think about it. Ha! Andross's base are nothing! Alright. Okay, let's move him forward. Oh, well, let's take care of this fucking... Alright, I will take care not, of this. Not today, not today, asshole! Not today, asshole! Okay, never mind. Never mind, sorry. <laughs> that is the silliest thing ever. Oh, you want to know another trivia? Yeah. This is going to be interesting, too. If you haven't played it yet, though, everybody remembers uh, Venom being a barren, deserted planet. Yes. Yet, on the quote-unquote direct sequel... Wait for it. Yes. Venom... Is very much habitable. Absolutely. It's even got a more of a joyful sound to it, the theme. Oh my god, there's a spider. Is that the dancing in sector? Look. Kinda looks like it. Just a smaller He's version of it. Shrunk. Spider. You need to find the switch to open up the entrance. Yeah. And this is what I need to look for. Some of these switches are are hid inside of uh, monsters, even. Yeah, that is also a really good uh, uh, concept, too. Yes, absolutely. It's too bad this game never came out, though. Yeah, I actually wanted to... I, I heard rumors back in the day that they were going to release it. Yeah, I remember that. Oh, here we go. This is my... These little pads right here. I like the thing here. Oh hell yeah. Tic tac toe. Tic tac toe indeed. Oh Jesus, what is it with people kamikazeing? I don't even me. know. God damn! I mean, oh Jesus, there it goes again. Fuck. Yep. They're trying to get the job done apparently. Yeah, they're. See, that's failing. how you know this game's Japanese. Yeah. Go. Oh god, um half we got fifty percent shields. Yeah. Up next next I'm gonna switch next time. Okay. Jesus Christ. Alright. Yeah, you can obviously see I'm heavily damaged. Now imagine having a wing damage, and then you go on the walker, and you all you do is hop. <laughs> if that actually is on here, I'm gonna laugh. Okay, check this out. Right into a shield. Yes. There you go. Prepare. Come here. Special weapon. What the hell did I just blow up? Special weapon. I cannot find a goddamn blaster anywhere. Okay, into the core we go. Yep. Yeah, this threw me off. Got a couple of turrets on this side. I am, I am, once again, excuse me, I am pretty rusty. Alright, here we go. The controls on this are pretty nice, actually. The curl They run much smoother compared to the beta version. I can see that. Yeah. Let me see what's up here. What's going on here? Oh god, that's very Star Foxes. Ish. I like how the uh, damage really reflects on, you know, uh, how much you took and if you're taking, yeah. Yeah. 
Okay, that's the shield. If somebody could give me a goddamn wing blaster, that'd be nice. Alright, here we go. And by the way, the wing blaster... Very hard hitting. Oh, yeah. Die, you asshole. Okay, now it's open. There you go! Alright, let's finish this off real quick. Oh god, what am I doing? Fuck. Yeah, I probably need to switch out uh, after this. Yeah. I don't remember this guy being in that part. Alright, so Venom's uh, taken care of. Yeah. How fucking anal do you have to be for Venom to go, Get the fuck out! <laughs> yeah, that's definitely. pretty much what happened to Andros. They've repopulated. Mm-hmm. Mm. Looks like I might have to sacrifice me. I would just switch over to Falco at this point. If it'll let me. Hey, oh, Star no. Fox. I, Star Wolf, will defeat you now. Okay, the uh, doo doo! That wasn't on the beta version, but all that in the background was not on the beta version. I'm Pepper to see you. I am the best pilot in the Lilac system. Now, notice that. What do we got? What do we got? Damn, he's fast. Yeah, I noticed that his wolf fin is in a different color. Yeah, I've noticed that. Like, what color was it? Blue. Yeah, I see it now. My opponent's always evaporated the space dust. Didn't realize that was a thing. It's like, what the heck? Oh man, it's pushing it close. Yeah, cutting it close. Oh yeah. Oh, you asshole! Getting close, getting close to it. Come here. Come here. There you go, there you go, there you go. Oh, you. Where are you? No! Oh god, one more hit and I'm dead. I'm gonna, I'm gonna barrel roll the shit out of this. Hey, we're getting close. You're almost there, you're almost there. Whoa, it almost hit an asteroid. Yeah. Now, in as you all know, I have a, a very bad habit of barrel rolling the shit out of my Harlins. Down you go, bitch! I'm impressed, Star Fox. You are talented. Today I lose, but tomorrow I shall crush you. At least you know he uh, lost with dignity. Mm-hmm. He was ass hurt in the beta version. Yeah. I need yeah. to be careful. I don't think Mew is gonna last. Well. All right, we're done playing fair. Yeah, he's he's in a space station, I think. Oh, hey! I forgot. We went. We ended up on Great Fox. Therefore... Ow! Didn't mean to do that. Fully repaired, so you should be fully loaded to go. Oh, yeah. Now, let me find a goddamn wing blaster. Alright, here we go.
Guards are gone. Okay, I'm gonna do right. Let's see what else we can figure out. Oh, oh yeah, there's a switch there. Yeah, I forgot. A biter. Yeah. A, bi a bipedal spider. You shouldn't even be a spider. You should be dirt. 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 Dirt of the yeah, crack. Oh, hey, Nova Bomb. Special weapon. No, it's a Nova Bomb. It's not a special weapon. It's a fucking Nova Bomb. Okay. Now, this was moving really fast in the beta version. The fire. Yeah. Or the lava, whatever you want to call it. There you go. There we go. Switch has been pushed. This is a goddamn puzzle, I'll tell you that much. Uh, not a very difficult one, though, just a little tedious. Yeah. Oh, so, oh. normal mode's a piece of cake. But I'll tell you something else. Hard mode is gonna be a little bit more difficult. Expert mode, they're gonna throw everything at you. How oh, yeah. can I not get hit? Not to mention, you also get, uh, one thing that's really cool about the, uh, expert mode, though, is you get to see the return of one of the first, uh, the first core, uh, first course boss on, uh, what is it, on, on Venom? Oh, yes. Yeah, Fantron actually returns in a different re uh, in a different reiteration of himself. Yes. Really cool one, I might add. Yeah. I have to say, I actually like him. And I believe you fight all of Star Wolf. Yes, you do. You fight all of Star Wolf. There he is. He's in there. There we go. Hey! I didn't see that. This is different. The logos. Basically, in the beta version, the logos consisted of skulls. It's pretty metal, if you ask me. Yeah, very metal. But it's pretty appropriate, though. For, I believe those are... Uh, that's uh, kanji, I believe. It looks like uh, the word beta. Like the correction, the... Uh, the uh, America uh, signal for the word beta. For beta. That's Andros. Still in a cube. In a cube. That's not. It's not over yet. It's almost like there was nothing to it. Yeah. There's something to it, but not nothing to it. Okay, that, there wasn't that many explosions in the beta version, by the way. Your existence ends here. I will put you to rest. Don't worry, it'll be quick. Oh, you're still in the mask. Yeah, he's still in the mask, yeah. I like, uh, of course, Three's uh, barrier mask better. Okay. Oh, yeah. This is another thing that we also came uh, came across as well mm -hmm. on the beta version. Um, he would go too far, and you would not be able to catch up to him to fight him. Yeah. Really deadly glitch. Yeah, it was a pretty bad glitch, yeah. Mm, did I get him? Fuck. I don't think he got him. Shit. Oh, yeah. Yeah, me is cutting it close. No. Nope. Bring you Not up. today, Satan. Not today, Satan. Where'd you, where'd you go? Turn to your right, turn to your right. No! No, 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 you're not doing it. Not today, motherfucker. Yeah, it took a little too much time there. Yeah. Now, in the expert mode, you actually get to see his face. It's actually really cool. It's basically a, a more a, an SNES pixelated version of his face from the uh, Star Fox 64 version. Which, well, put it this way, though. Which would eventually become Andros' face in Star Fox 64. Okay, listen. I control the Lilac system. Hell yeah. Now, the thing about this, you only get two continues. 
there are no credits. There's just two continues. If one pilot dies, your backup is your last chance, is your last ditch effort, basically. Basically, when you choose a team, make it count. Yeah. There's a reason why we chose Falco. Exactly. Alright, let's go. You will never get deployed, dude. You will never destroy me. That's so, asshole. Is that so? So here we go again. Falco? I chose you for a reason. Oh, whoopsies. My fault, Falky. Alrighty. Also, if you get set on fire, I don't know why that took me so long. If you get set on fire, you can barrel roll to put yourself out. I just... Uh I like that concept. Yes. I need, to, I need to generate my shield now. And by the way, I better stop talking shit about spiders, because I think that might have been the reason- Ah! Oh, there we go. Special weapon. This is also a special weapon. So look at that. Now I'm saving the last. I'm saving the last of it for Angross. Is there a goddamn ring blaster anywhere? Shit. I think not. I think they may have taken it out. That's fucked up. That's really <laughs> fucked up. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. That is pretty messed up. If that is legit, or they're saving the blasters for the harder difficulties. In that case, if, if that's true, then good job, Nintendo. I mean, Nintendo's known for making really, really, really bad mistakes. Really bonehead mistakes. But also very well known for making really interesting challenges. Yeah. And I have to... I'm out... The first gaming console that I ever played was the Super Nintendo. Therefore... Um, I was a Nintendo girl. I'm, I'm, I started off as a Nintendo girl from day one, and I will always forever be a Nintendo girl. Yeah, that's what we all started, though. Even though I love the yeah. shit out of Aaron Black. Yeah, my origins are from the uh, Nintendo as well. I remember playing uh, the original Mario Bros. as well, but yeah. the game I remember playing the most growing up, uh, whenever I was, uh, I was learning how to read. I learned how to play, uh, like I was playing Final Fantasy, the original. I read it all the time. And I remember uh, learning how to read, uh, playing the original Final Fantasy. Mm -hmm. That was really cool. Very, I remember. I remember the very first time you played Doom. Oh yeah, Doom on the Super Nintendo, that was a... Uh... Yeah. <laughs> That was a really, really pixelated and just glitchy port, though, but it was the best one on a console. It was even better than the 32X. Yeah. And I've played the 32X version and the Sega Saturn version, and I gotta tell you, I, I always go back to the uh, SNES version. Mm-hmm. I think the Super Nintendo version is a better one, in my opinion. It has a charm to it. I don't know how to... I don't know how to describe it, though. There's a certain charm to it that I'm just attracted to. Go. Now let's try this again. Alright. Let's end this. You don't, you don't want to fuck with Falco. Do not fuck with Falco. Bird versus a monkey. Oh no, birds can kill, man. I've seen birds hunt cats. Yeah! That's fucking scary. Grown, grown cats, not just kittens. It's a goddamn tragedy because it's it's saddening because I love cats. But it's you know the way of nature. What can you say? It's the way of nature. You gotta eat some um, animals. Gotta eat. So you gotta hunt. Yeah. Whoa, fucker! 
Out today, Satan. Go down, down. There, there is, there is. All right, it's on the other one. Finish him off. Finish him off. All right, there we go. There we go. There we go. Whoa! Okay, he's nearby, he's nearby. There you go. Getting close, getting close, getting close, getting close. Whoa! Oh! <laughs> what the hell just happened? I just... I used my, uh... Oh, nice. Emergency repair. Yes. Wow, okay, I don't I don't ever remember seeing that on the beta. No, there it was on the beta. Cause your special weapons consisted of three things. Your shield, your wing um your Nova Bombs, and the uh, emergency uh, regenerator. See I'd never seen that before. Oh it's that comes in handy and if I it's really tough for me to choose which special weapon I go with. Because they're all really good. There is a, a certain balance to it, though, that I seem to like. Yeah. Come here. Okay, let's this Come here, asshole. Get over here. Down you there go, we asshole. go. Suck it, Andros. Mm-hmm. Suck it, Wong. Suck it! Trust me, there is more to this. Oh yeah, she she can tell you. This is not going to be the only playthrough, by the way. Yeah, we plan on actually having a few more episodes. Mm -hmm. We're actually, uh, or if not a few more episodes, we'll probably just you know it'll be extra mode after this. Because you know there's other things that we want to uh, just just discover as well. Mm -hmm. And Star Fox. It was a What the mythic? There's more voice acting. Let's head back to the area. I do like the voice acting on here. It's not I can't say it's better than the first game because you can never outdo the This is Corneria, Pepper speaking. Congratulations on, on the job, job well done. done. Corneria has been saved. Andros is no more that we think. Executing security cross check. Access granted. Now these are the names. Now in the in the first game you only had the bosses. Yeah. In this game, during the credits, they show every um, enemy you come across uh, during the playthrough. Yes. Or more like you know, in the difficulty. Can, oh god! Can you imagine? Oh, there's another thing that Night Fang. Interesting. There is a another thing that I noticed in both this version and the beta. There is no sector stage. There isn't. There isn't. So they took it out. It's not on. It's not on Star Fox. It's not on this one. Well, I mean, I mean, it, we could be wrong though, because you know we've only played just on normal mode. Yeah, maybe I could be wrong. Yeah. Skull Toad. There's nothing about that that looks like a goddamn skull. Not really. Kind of betrayer. Oh, that's a nice name. I like that. Kind of betrayer. That's actually. Doesn't beat the Great Commander though. Nope. Shit. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I just, I, shit. I just. N never mind. Mirage Dragon. That's actually a great name. But I don't see any mirages. Unless he was bigger. Huh. 
I find it kind of sad that yeah. he was the on the Star Wolf the, team yeah. or the Wolf team. Yeah, before they were called Star Wolf. I like the way the Wolfins look. You can definitely tell that Star Wolf's uh, Wolfin as the uh, the leader. Mm -hmm. Of course, Andros. That is not the true Andros, though. No, it's not. The end? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it wants me to push start. Oh, what are we... What are we... Oh, would you look at that? Sorry, Miu. Sorry, Miu. Killed in action. Oh, fuck you! <laughs> it's not that bad. Below the bronze medal. It's not that bad. Like... It's been a while, like I said, so... Yeah. There's, yeah, there's never really been a true completion of this, though, so... So... Yeah, this was uh, pretty fun, though. Don't, don't, don't hate! <laughs> no, we ain't hating, though, but, you know, we still got a lot of... We still got a lot to figure out, too. Yeah, we got a lot to figure out. There will be more episodes, and, um... <sighs> there's something so peaceful about this. I mean, does this sound like... Some... This sounds so peaceful. Does it sound like sound like something you hear when you have a baby? Pretty much, yeah. It sounds like you know a little baby's little tune. Baby being born. I like that. I'm putting my initials in. I like that, don't you? Age. That's my initial. By the way, that's my full initials. All right. Well, uh, we'll be returning to this real soon. And uh, as far as uh, Final Fantasy VI uh, is concerned, letting you know right now though, that uh, the final episode, uh, the final episodes, will be coming soon. But uh, we'll say this right now though, we would, we really wanted to get to a Star Fox too though, because this is something that we've been waiting on for a few years now. Mm -hmm. But yeah, uh, once we finish everything else with uh, Star Fox two, I will be continuing Final Fantasy VI. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, and just for an update though. I came across a, uh, a save state issue that kind of pushed me back seven hours in the game, so I gotta, you know, recatch up and just do a few things as well. So, yeah, that's gonna just be a little bit longer. But other than that, stay tuned. Star Fox 2 is gonna be complete soon, and then right after that, though, we we'll, I will be uh, continuing for with Final Fantasy VI. <sighs> ah, Sapporo. Mm hmm. Yeah. Yeah, swig a beer of that, huh? Mm -hmm. Swig a beer. Mm. Much love, and I will see y'all later. See y'all on the on expert mode, actually.